Hello there guys, my name is Kay Shadogs the Born Book Built for Theme Park News and welcome to a Theme Park News update from Grona Lund in Sweden. Now this is a construction update, not the longest video in the world today, but this is a construction update looking at what's been happening recently with Monster, their brand new Bulgar and Mabiard inverted roller coaster coming to the park in 2021. Now we do have some construction updates as the lift hill has been topped off. This is brilliant. Um, so we do have a couple of pictures from Coaster Blog, who's a Swedish um, social media uh, producer and influencer for theme parks. So massive shout out to Coaster Blog for the pictures used in this video. Uh, but for now, guys, we're going to talk about what we see on the construction site as well as telling you guys some stats about this ride for those of you who are new to the channel and don't know much about this ride and then share my thoughts on the recent construction update so before we get started make sure you like comment subscribe click the notification bell so you never miss another thrilling youtube video uh, we're getting closer and closer to 2,000 subscribers and nearly half a million views in total so make sure you get your comments in make sure you keep viewing the old videos as well make sure you go through the nostalgia videos and uh, get that view count up and for now let's get started by looking at the construction on site so over the last couple of days, the lift hill, as you can see on your screen, has been topped off. And you can see the wonderful construction there uh, as the lift hill is coming down the turn. It looks The turn very much looks like a Banshee at Kings Island drop, uh, where it's like a turning drop. And, you know, ever since I found in this park first back in 2011... Uh, as a young coaster fan, I've wanted to see an invert at this park, and it's finally going ahead. And uh, this has been an incredible project to follow. Uh, now, of course, uh, if you want some stats on this ride, this ride will have a length of 2,296.6 feet, a height of 111.5 feet, a speed of 55.9 miles per hour, and it has three inversions, two zero G rolls, and a corkscrew. Um, and it will also have an arrangement of six cars per train with four across in a single row for a total of 24 riders per train. Of course, we know it's manufactured by Bulgar and Mabillard and it's confirmed to open for the 2021 season. So there we go. That is the latest construction pictures. Again, massive shout out to Coaster Blog for them pictures. And um, very exciting construction. You saw a second picture on there which talked about the lift hill work. Um, over the last day and they were doing some work on like the, the top of the lift hill just to like fit it into place and fix it into place uh, but we saw the turn of the drop which was very very nice as well um, so like I said before the, the actual lift drop looks very much like Banshee at Kings Island with that uh, drop of course that's the uh, inverted coaster at Kings Island in Ohio in America uh, that replaced part of the site of the old Son of Beast roller coaster. Of course, you guys know uh, the Son of Beast story. Um, but it, it reminds me of Banshee, that, that lift hill drop. And um, that gives me incredible signs about this ride. Now, like I said, this is opening in 2021. And, you know, like I've said, this this coaster, this invert at Grona Lund has had a lot of history. You know, there was there was rumoured plans of an invert coming, I think it was around 2008, 2009, something like that. Uh, between 2007 and 2009, I think. And uh, we were rumoured to get an invert round there. And of course, you know, for um, we did get it in the end. And because Grunland is such a small park, of course, they've got to close off the construction site while the park's operating. But, um, you know, and then off winter, they sort of do more work on it. But now they've got more work done on it, this coaster is going to be completed by the end of this year, in my opinion. I think the construction of the track work will be done by the end of... Uh, 2020 we're going to see testing probably early 2021 uh, for this ride uh, we know that the COVID restrictions are going to be staying in place in Sweden until 2022 they've handled the situation really really well over there um, and you know fair play to the Swedish government for handling, handling the situation obviously it's not good financially for the parks but you know you've got to do what you've got to do and uh, you know they're handling the situation over there in Sweden very very well with the COVID restrictions and you know it's nice to, to see them handling it so well. Um, so I think this will still open in 2021. But I think they'll just have the restrictions in place anyway. Um, but I'm very excited for the construction I've seen from this. So again, massive shout out to uh, Coaster Blog for those pictures uh, of construction. Of course, the information from Roller Coaster Database about uh, the stats for the ride. But for now, guys, thank you very, very much for watching this construction update on the brand new Monster Inverter Coaster at Grona Lund for 2021. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, click the notification bell so you never miss another thrilling YouTube video. And for now, my name is Coach Chow. Keep living the coast life. And I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, guys.
Carlos. 